Hey guys, I'm out in the garage today and I'm working on my sister's car. I'm in the middle of changing the lower control arm bushing, specifically the rear bushing on that front lower control arm. I just ran into the situation where the lower control arm bolt is seized inside of the bushing and the bolt is just spinning. And if you found this video, you're probably in the same situation. Now, after Googling it, I found that a lot of the solutions involve just cutting off the bolt and replacing the entire control arm. But she just had these lower ball joints replaced. So I hate for her to have spent this much money to replace those lower ball joints and then just have to spend that extra money to replace the entire arm. The bushings are only about 20 bucks. The whole arm is about 100. So I found this solution and this is the reason why I decided to do this video is if you're in the same boat as me, you can just run that bolt until it spins a little bit and then pry up on the worn bushing. And what I did is I just pried up here. I'm going to shine a light so you can see. So pry up on the bushing a little bit. And as soon as you can see that sleeve, I actually welded the sleeve to the subframe. And that allowed me to then turn out the bolt with an impact. So now, once that bolt is out, I'm just going to zip cut that weld out of there. So rather than cut out the entire bolt, have to find another bolt, end up with that cut bolt in the uh, captive nut. Instead, I'm just going to have to clean up that one weld and uh, the bolt should go right back in. All right, so I just got it cut out and I have it here. You can see the weld on the bushing that I cut out. And for the boys at work, I was using my zip cut without a guard. Yep, one of the few times that you'll catch me doing it. Of course, I had my full face shield, so don't worry. But yeah, that came out real nice. As soon as I got enough weld on that sleeve, the bolt came right out. Hope you found this video helpful. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do. And I'll see you in the next one.